Bigfoots are scary. Hey there, it's Mike. And this is Mike's editorials. Will robots take over the world? That's today's topic. Will it happen? Let's find out. Over the years, we have experienced lots of movies with robots. You know, um, like the Terminator and probably iRobot, for example. But mostly Terminator is what everyone thinks about when it comes to robots taking over the world. But why do we fear official intelligence in the first place? We are currently making robots, some of which can be smart. With further involvement with the technology, we could be at the point of having robots with super artificial intelligence. But that's unlikely until 100 years from now. With further involvement with our technology, we could be to the point of actually making super artificial intelligence. But that's not until a hundred years from now, so... <laughs> I probably won't be alive that long. I mean, a hundred? I mean, 127? Do you, want, do you want me to live that long to experience that? I don't think so. Um... According to Stephen Hawking, wow, a reference to someone in real life in my editorials? What am I doing? I mean, this is unbelievable. Computers will overtake humans with AI at some within the next hundred years. When that happens, we need to make sure that computers have goals in line with ours. The development of full artificial intelligence could Spill the end of the human race. What? 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 what does he believes if he. Be Are you serious? It would take off on its own and redesign itself at a ever increasing rate. Humans who are limited by slow biological evolution couldn't compete. Ugh. That's. So scary. Seriously, we need to stop what we're doing. Stop this technology bullcrap. Stop making these robots because we're making our doom end here with the robots here in our future for the future generations. So we'll stop it right now. Stop it. I mean, do we need robots? I mean, robots are taking over our jobs now. I mean, that's okay, I guess, but let's make robots for certain things, you know? And that's it. Nothing else. Don't do anything rational with these robots. Now, here's the thing about robots. I've been thinking about this. We're getting closer to self-driving cars now, and I'm just afraid that these self-driving cars will have a fault in their programming, and, you know... That will lead into chaos. I mean, it could be possible. Sometimes we're not perfect as human beings and we end up creating mistakes. Some for the good, some for the worse. Actually, thinking about self-driving cars, it reminds me of the 80s classic known as Knight Rider with Kit. He's a smart car. He was a self-driving car. <laughs> Oh my god, that's right. In the same series, there was an evil car known as Car, which spells out K A R R. Uh, get rid of this guy! Very well. Kit, Car was here. It's got Barry and Michael. Well done, Mr. Miles.
Well, car is an example that could happen in real life, maybe. I hope not. Wait a minute. Elon Musk was quoted about this? Ah, oh, what did he say? He said, I think we should be very careful about our official intelligence. If I were to guess at what our biggest threat is, it's probably that. With artificial intelligence, we are summoning the demon. The demon? What? Oh no, I hate the future now. <sighs> We're doomed. Seriously, if both Stephen Hawking and Elon Musk, the, the brightest minds right now on Earth, I don't know what else to say. <sighs> robots, what about robots? Oh, oh, you know, we could save ourselves with this. We could save ourselves with this. Hold on, hear me out. As we evolve as humans, we some of us are becoming cyborgs. There are uh, interchangeable parts that we will change out, like uh, legs and arms, and eventually, you know, machine parts to make us better to live longer in life. And it kind of reminds me of like Robocop in a way, or Six Million Dollar Man, where we have the technology, we can build it, we make them better. And, you know, that could probably help us fight against these robots, you know, in the end. You know, the cyborgs versus these robots that could take over the world here. This 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 could be a this could be a good idea. <laughs> but wait, 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 wait. Shit. I didn't even think about this. I didn't think about this. What if the robotics in our system go haywired? and turn evil on us, then we're definitely screwed. <sighs> There's no win-win situation here. If this keeps going at the rate as it's going, we're, we are dooming the future generation here, and I don't know what to think of the future now. People of Earth, please stop advancing technology here. I don't want the future. Please stop this right now. For the love of God, we could save the future generations if we do not do anything now. Please, God. Oh, cross my fingers and hopefully, hopefully our future is going to be okay without robots. Ugh. I'm going back to bed. Oh, and... By the way, I'm Mike, and this has been Mike's editorial. Thank you for watching, and adios, amigos. Mm. Mm.